guys and today's video is going to be a haul video and this is just basically everything that I have bought within the month of January um it's the, I'm not going to do this every month because I very rarely actually shop for various different things but obviously with January sales and things this month and I actually went shopping um on Saturday so I bought a few things then so I just thought I would show you everything that I bought this month and the first thing that I'm going to show you guys is this and it's got a little pocket on it I don't know if it'll go too dark but it's actually a cardigan it's not got any um like buttons or anything but it is the comfiest warmest um cardigan that i actually own and as you can see it's bright yellow and i absolutely love it it's really nice and cozy it is absolutely freezing it was freezing yesterday and i actually went out with just this on and i have a vest top on underneath it and i am really really warm and cozy um i got this from primark and it was in the sale as well and it was only about something like about five pounds and i think it's called the popcorn cardigan or something but i absolutely love it and it's really really nice so you'll probably see this in a few of my videos now because i am literally gonna live in this thing um but i do have quite a few other things that i have bought and i have put them in my betty boo bag that i got for christmas just to keep them all together and i know what i bought and stuff um i actually got some wrapping paper but that's not really exciting and i actually got this from primark as well i actually saw this um at the uh the, the queue thing when you're going into pay they have like loads of like other little stuff um as well so i actually picked up some of this so now i can wrap up aaron's birthday present yay so that's the only thing that's boring um the other stuff is in here so i'm just gonna pick it out randomly and then i will tell you where it is from and possibly how much it is from um Okay, so I'll start off with this one. Um, I actually bought this in December. And this is Makeup Academy's Undress Your Skin. And it's a shimmer highlighter. Now, this is like a pinky sort of colour. And I bought this back in December, as I said. And I absolutely love this one. So, Makeup Academy do two different ones. And... <clears throat> this there you go this one is like a it's like a white golden sort of shimmery one so i already had this one and i really really loved it so i wanted to try this one and i have seen somewhere i think it's on instagram or twitter that this is a drugstore dupe for the nars one um so i really wanted to try this one so i got that one from superdrug and i think it was three pounds so it is quite cheap so i got those then a little bit boring i got some makeup wipes these ones are the cl uh, cleansing facial wipes and they are for sensitive skin you get 25 wipes in them and it gently cleans and refreshes uh removes waterproof mascara and it's fragrance free which is a bonus because obviously i have sensitive skin so i got those and in the aisles while i was queuing up they have quite a few things there so i got some um nail varnish remover this does have acetone in it so as you can see i've got my nails painted and they will be coming off later so that'll come in handy for when i want to take it off um and then another boring thing is i got some more cotton buds um and then i got some more of my cream i use the garnier um range for creams and i don't really mind which one i use but in the winter time i tend to go for ones that are for dry skin because my skin does get very very dry in the winter time 
but as obviously spring and summer is approaching I can go back to this one is the Ultralift Complete Beauty and it is it says that it's a day cream but I, I probably use it day and night um, this one is to prevent wrinkles which I don't actually mind um, I mind that because I do like this formula but I don't actually have any wrinkles when I smile no, don't have any wrinkles. So this one will prevent, it's an anti-wrinkle firm, firming radiation boost. And I absolutely love this one. So I got that and I think this one was, oh, I had the receipt. This one was 6 99 I think. Or it might be 7 99 I don't know, um, but I got this anyway, and I oh um yeah, but I got this anyway, so yeah, um and then if we're sticking on to Superdrug, then I will probably show you everything that I got from Superdrug. So got a pile of it here. So the first thing that I got was a repurchase and I used the um, the foundation for this concealer but this one is the Better Skin um, Superstay Concealer um, and this one is in 02 and it is like clear um, and Basically, I absolutely love this. Um, my other one is literally near enough where I'm out. Um, but sometimes I don't even use the foundation um, because this just gives you enough coverage anyway. And I absolutely love this. So that one was a repurchase. Um, and then um, I have the Maybelline Lash Sensational which is all over the TV at the moment and I actually saw this on the TV on the adverts and I thought I'm going to try this I really am going to try it so I have it on at the minute and it is it's quite nice but the wand is really weird because at the bottom of it I don't know whether or not you can see but the bristles are quite small whereas the one at the top they're quite big so depending on how you rotate the one the bristles go like underneath they're quite well, quite short so you can probably do like your bottom lashes with that one and then like obviously as you turn it um they get bigger it's probably a little bit like that where you can see like the bristles are quite short and then they're quite quite big but i am absolutely loving this at the minute so love that um, then I got to Makeup Academy to get some of the shimmer stuff and I actually got it on if you can see that uh, it's really really nice so I got a brow defining tinted brow mascara by Makeup Academy as well I absolutely love Makeup Academy stuff I've got loads of it um, that's all it is it's just like a little wand and then obviously like you run that through your brows i've not actually tried this yet so i'll have to let you know how i'll get on with that one um i have a new color tattoo absolutely love this color this one is uh number 70 metallic pomegranate or pomegranate pomegranate um that is the color of it is absolutely beautiful as you can see i have tested it already that's why my fingerprint is in there but it is a really 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 nice color so i am gonna have to have a play about with this and see what i can do with it um but i really do love this color so that was that one and then i had to go I had to, and I know I've got quite a few of these already, but I had to go and get a Tanya Burr lip gloss. The one that I was actually looking for wasn't there, um, 
So I got this one which is Smile, Dream and Sparkle. And this is the prettiest colour ever. It is absolutely pretty. And this one has li little bits of like shimmery, sparkly bits in there. But I absolutely love, 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 love this colour. I really do love it. So, back to the bag. Um, I got some stuff from Primark um, because we went into Primark and I got a highlighter pencil from Primark and even though it's only a pound um, I've never used a high pardon me excuse me um i've never used a highlighting pencil before so if i find that i can't work with it then it's only a pound really that i've just spent and like you know as opposed to some of the other brands that you can get so um yeah i got one of those to see how i get on with it and then i got a lipstick from their range as well um this was only something like i think it was like 80p or something but it is a pretty bright pink colour. Um, I have actually worn this before and it is really, really nice. So I've got that one as well. And I like the fact that obviously it's got the colour on the bottom. So when you store it, I, I store it like that in a holder. So I can see like, obviously the colour of it. So I like that. Um, and then I got some rings these were only a pound but the rings are quite quite nice and you get like different ones in there as well so you got like a little flower and then just some other little bits of dangly ones as well um so i like those and then i got some shoes i got these i don't know what you call these some people call them tom toms some people just call them pumps some people just call them flats um, but they basically got like a bit of a stretch here and they are grey I am a size 5 which is probably why they seem really small or they look really big to me on there um, but yeah I don't actually own any sort of shoes like this and I thought well with again with spring and summer coming I thought that these would be really really nice to wear um, with like some jeans or whatever um so yeah i got some of them um and then i went into boots because super drug don't actually sell natural natural collection brand like the brand thing so i had to go into boots to get it and this is the face powder that i actually use the press powder um and I was looking all over Stockport for this and I had to go into the centre of Manchester to meet my sister on Friday and she wanted me to go and get her something and it was in boots so while I was there I had a look for this one and I was cringing because I didn't think I would see my colour but then I found it. I, I love these particularly because they are for sensitive skin and they don't have any fragrance in them um, and obviously they are $1.99 so it's even better, love these. Um, and then I did a bit of online shopping. So the first thing I'm going to show you is this one which is from Maybelline and this is just like a bronzer but it's quite shimmery as well um and it's in the color 03 s tiger i think that's the color um and i got this from amazon basically amazon's prices change all the time so there's no point in me telling you how much everything is from amazon because it won't be that price now so what i normally do is i normally type in like makeup and then i go through like everything if there's something there that i like the look of then i will put it onto my wish list and then i'll just keep watching the prices of everything to see like when they go down and things like that so that is basically what i did with this next thing which is a palette as you can see 
but you open it up and it is actually a blusher palette um when i got this i think it was something like three pounds something um but obviously as i said the prices do change and they do vary so this is an amazing palette um i absolutely love it and i have this color on at the moment if you can just see underneath there um i've used this one quite a lot i've used that one before and then this one as well and they are really really pigmented as well which is amazing so yeah i got that i absolutely love that palette um and then aaron actually got me um a lipstick by maybelline and this is the color sensational pop stick and this one is actually in cherry pop and i don't know whether or not you're going to be able to see this but it is actually see-through and it is weird because no color actually comes off them it's like a tinted lip balm and the more you put on the more color you can see so i just think i just find it really really strange of how like they are um like see-through so this one is the cherry pop it comes in like a little thing like that so i went on to amazon and had a look and i got myself crystal pink which is zero four zero and it looks the exact same it's see-through again but the color looks so similar to it and they don't smell of anything so they just look really nice so i got that <clears throat> and then last but not least i do not know how to pronounce that so i will go in and you can probably see what it says there but it is an actual eyeliner and i thought this looked really really strange so i thought i was going to i was going to have to buy it and try it i've not tried it yet but I just think it looks really, really weird. And this uh, this came the other day and Aaron said to me, oh, you've got a new lipstick. And I said, no, I haven't. And I showed it him and he's like, oh my God, that's black. I said, yeah, because it's an eyeliner, but it just looks like a lipstick. How confusing to men would that be? And last but not least, I went out in some money and, <clears throat> excuse me, the change wasn't a lot. So I just said to him, I got a mission for you. Go into Superdrug and get me two Makeup Academy lipsticks. I absolutely love their lipsticks. Um, but I haven't actually got one on at the minute. I have Let's Travel the World by Tanya Burr on at the minute. But um, anyway, I asked him to go in and get two lipsticks. So he did. The first one that he got me was is called um, Wild Berry. Looks like that. It's very, very pretty, like dark reddishy. It's like a dark reddishy purpley colour. Um, and I was quite surprised because Makeup Academy's lipsticks look like that with the colour underneath. But this is black. This one is white because it is a matte lipstick and I don't actually own any matte lipsticks so I was quite surprised that he actually picked me out two colours that are really really nice and then I have Lil uh, this is Lilac or Lilac uh, Bella which is a purpley colour which is really really nice again this is a matte lipstick and I just cannot believe that I got some really, really pretty colours. Um, the one thing that I do like about uh, Makeup Academy lipstick is, like, obviously the packaging is, um, like, either black or white. But I like the fact that they have the colour underneath. And this little pot actually comes off, so you've got extra colour in this little pot for when you run out and it also makes it easier for when you're storing them because obviously you can just see the colour there 
as opposed to having to keep getting it out and going no i don't want that one and stuff like that so i do like the packagings of these but i was so surprised that he actually got me these and he was a little bit curious as to why i've asked him but the real reason behind it is because i just wanted to see what he would actually get me so yeah so that is it for everything that i have gotten this month and i shall see you in my next video bye